Hello, this is Praise Clash from Eden Webby 3D, a developer of all the add ons on Eden Webby. So, um, you guys have been having a problem with Sound React, so I decided to create a tutorial for you to show you how to use this add on. Uh, most of you have been having problems with the uh, with the active keyframe. Well, what this what this option does is is it adds a keyframe on the first it adds it adds a, a sound react on the first keyframe of that object. You have to make sure it's the first, the active, or the only keyframe in that object. So let me show you an example. Uh, let me let me let me say I have a cube here, and I I want to animate the emission. If I set the color to black, I want to animate the emission. Let it mid color. Yes, I want to animate the emission. Eh? I want to let my sound react to the emission of this object. So what I do is uh, if I set it to zero. So what I do is um, I select my sound. You select any sound. I have a bunch of sounds here. I select it all on that object and add insert keyframe. So select active keyframe. You select active keyframe meaning it's going to add sound to this active keyframe that is on the object the first and only so before you do before you animate this object first do this if you're going to use sound react then click react play so. So what we can do, or another thing we can do is, uh, uh, we don't duplicate, just add another cube since, since another cube. Um, so this cube is reacting to base, base, uh, yeah, you have base, kick, mild, high, treble, full, full is every frequency. So I want, I uh, want this this cube to react to uh, high 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 frequencies those those uh, snares voices and everything this cube so again see what I'm going to do I am going to make sure this cube has no animation you can use anything as long as it has no animation in it just it has to be one object or any or even a bone as long as there is no keyframe on it and as long as that keyframe is the active uh, keyframe because it's going to add sound react to the active keyframe that is on that object so it's the, there's a lot of a lot, a lot of uh, and, and a lot of uh, and a lot of keyframes in it. To, to have a hard time to select which one so um let's set the color to black black nah. white black no let's let's give this blue let's make no let's make it yellow so it's the same sound, you're just going to react to high. So there's an error. Let me check it out. Oh, no, no. So the error has come because there's no active keyframe. That's why it's, it has brought an error. So add insert keyframe on this, then click here. Play. so that's it if you uh if you want to increase the values um what you can do is uh 
what you can do is uh, you can use a math node here and you animate the math node instead of the default strength values you can use math node to multiply the values times a certain value then you animate so yeah. <laughs> crazy another thing so you uh, with the with the with the with the with the scale and data path data path is is uh as simple so data path is if you want to 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 animate your own anything that you want you can just select the data path an example is uh what what, what should i this cube an example is um let me say i want to want to move this cube on the z-axis so i copy the data path copy data path i paste it right here data path data path is location and i click yeah but yeah play crazy these places location so you can change your uh, location dot x location dot z change your animation uh, that's it <laughs>